fellow future corpses. I am Will Botch, and this is Silent Hill 2, the remake. I think we're on uh, part six now. What all happened last time? We escaped the Blue Creek Apartments. We fought Pyramid Head. I'm not sure if I actually had to fight him. He kind of walked off in the end, so I probably didn't have to waste all my ammo. Then we uh, walked out and came back to like the normal world. Normal world? In which we saw the little girl again that stomped my hand. She called me a big dum dumb and ran off. We made it to Rosewater Park. And uh, after walking for a few, we met Maria, who's standing over there. Maria, I guess, looks like my wife. And uh, she was trying to help me find a place that's like the special area. Because apparently the first place I went to where I met her, I think was the first one. And then now she's taking me to like another secret area. And then uh, traveling through, we got attacked by things. We went through a motel. We went through like a weird uh, fog windstorm where there was a whole bunch of monsters at. And then we ended up at a strip club. The only place in Silent Hill that apparently has everything. It's got booze. It's not completely in ruins. It's got full electric. It's so far the best place to be in Silent Hill. And then I attempted to pole dance. That was the thing I did. We loot as much as we could. I got bullets. So well, let's get going. Let me know when you want to move on. Let's go. All right, then. Come on. Let's go. You and me, Maria. I wish I could give you uh, Angela's knife. That'd be cool. So you know you can stab monsters. Well, it's got everything we need. It's got uh, drinks. It's probably got some form of food. It's got gumballs. It's got gumballs. And uh, arcade machines. I don't think it's a bad idea. It's a, it's a place we can go to that's got everything we need. Oh, uh, no. Blasted pallets. Blocking my path. How will I proceed? All right, where am I going? Where did I come from? Where to go? I bet Moonlight Grove is where I'm going. Without her saying. Looking for them lootables. Uh, give me them lootables. Ah. Uh, lootable. 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 Lootable? Even though I could see it all the way back there. Let's sound this way. This is a dead end. Let's go explore the dead end. Oh, I thought I saw maybe something in the other seat, so I broke it to kind of see a little bit better. It doesn't appear to be anything up there. Back into the fog we go. I don't see anything in there. Hello. Look, we're on the other side of that chasm. The chasm. Detour. But hey, at least we're here. Here meaning where exactly? Come on, you'll find out. Can't you just tell me? We're kind of in a situation where there's monsters and stuff. Yeah, that's a calm. They're coming. No. That's something I want to bring up. Like when they're when they're having the whole uh, bar scene, and he's like, "Do you think I'm crazy, bro? We are in Silent Hill. It's foggy all the time. We've got this BS going on." We've entered another world. There's monsters. You got a letter from your dead wife that died three years ago saying, come to a special place. You're meeting up with random people. There's monsters. We went to a different reality. Do I think you're crazy? I think you're crazy for thinking you're crazy. 
Because why would your not wife not be alive at this point? With all the things that you've experienced so far. Sure. Why not? This is it. Yeah, I knew it. Alright, I shook up my gun first. That's it. A garden. There's a bit more to it than that. It's pretty. You say so. I don't think I've been here before. Come on. She's just around the corner. She? I knew I couldn't trust you. What'd you lead me to? What's going to kill me? told around these parts kind of a local legend it tells of a woman who was cast out sentenced to die on an island out on the lake there was a man in town who fell madly in love with her <laughs> and every night he would sneak out row across the lake bringing her food and company <laughs> and every night she would stand there on the shore holding a lit candle to help him find his way but this one night a terrible storm broke out caught him out in the open and it blew out the candle even in darkness the man would not give up he would not turn back so he fought against the raging waters until finally the lake took him. They say even then, the woman never lost hope. She kept coming out at night, kept lighting the candle to bring her beloved home, to lead him to shore. <laughs> Not sure how much truth there is to it. It's probably just a fairy tale. But she's become something of a local saint. A patron of undying love. Hence this place. She's not here. What? She's not here. And why would she be? I don't even remember this place. Okay. There's plenty of other places to look. We can still. Uh row. Come on. Uh row. Is that Pukin Eddie? Why hasn't he resurfaced? I've heard someone scream, but I need lootables. I think it came from inside the theater. That's cool. Well, I want more bullets and health. So whoever screamed in the theater can wait a minute. Alright, we're still good. Bam. Up. That seems to be locked. I guess we're just dead. Return 
Do oh creep. I can't read. I butchered that. Well, looks like they're dead. I can't get in. Oh, that's how we get in. You okay? Yeah. Maybe you better wait here. Okay. Not much of a movie fan anyway. You know you got a pipe, you like break yeah. the glass a little Be bit. Be careful in there. Yeah. Try breaking out that glass a little bit more. You got that uh, tarp blanket there. You could uh, use that too. This is boring. You didn't seem bored a minute ago. You screamed your head off, didn't you? <laughs> you should have seen your face. I told you. This is his They follow me here. Besides, I blocked the door, so no one could get in. Not the cops, and not these other monsters. You're weird. Yeah, that's what everyone always says. Well, I guess people call me weird too, and they yell at me, especially when I do something bad. Did you do something bad? You know, so the cops are angry with you. I don't know. So, why don't you just say you're sorry? It always works for me. They wouldn't listen. Nobody ever listens. Alright, I didn't want to interrupt their uh, chat. I was trying to see if I could, like, if their movie screen would change or anything. We don't seem too scared about it. Ah, we've got I Was Here based on the best selling book and No Existence and Artificial Sky. Ah, lootables. All right, what's in here? Anyone in here? I know where I must go, but I want to go there last. Aha! Nothing. Aha! No, oh, nothing. Waiting for one of those damn, like, uh, crawling ones to come out from underneath the stall and get me. Ha! Ah, it is I. Making sure there's no monsters in the bathroom. Ah, uh, monster in here. Nope. There's bullets. That's a. Why is that a toilet turned to the side? That's weird. All right. Well, we got these. I'm surprised you're not more concerned with this big rustling sound of me just blasting through stuff. Hello? Have you never walked down like a movie theater lighted stairs before? Just the way at first he was walking down it. Eddie? Oh. Hmm. You're, uh... James. We met back at the apartment building. Yeah, I remember. That ice cream? What, used to be ice cream? You didn't make it out yet. Mm, yeah. 
I just didn't get around to it yet. Well, at least you got your appetite back. Are you alone here, Eddie? Um, no. Well, that's probably just Laura messing around. The little girl? Laura, is that her name? That's what she said. I'm gonna go look for her. Eddie's so sweaty. You coming? Now you want me to come with you? Never mind. What a tool. That stuff looks delicious, right? Right? Is he still over here just mowing away on it? Who is that girl anyway? I don't know. All I know is her name. I swear. Uh, didn't you want to go after her? Better hurry. Laura can be pretty quick when she wants to. <laughs> Suit yourself. You are quite unhelpful, my friend. Why is my controller vibrating? Oh. Oh, are we watching a movie? Laura? What movie are we watching? I go down the rows? Oh, that means there's probably items in these rows. Some of these rows. Can I fit through these? No. Not that one. Maybe the one that's open. Hello? Not a fan of that. I don't even know what that is. But I'm not a fan to it. Laura! Laura? Laura? Nothing. Nothing. She down there now? Laura? We got some music coming out from over here. Right through there. I think you'd have fit through there without moving that if you just crouched a little bit more, sir. Hey! Well, I'm going to check this out. If you're going to keep running from me, I'm going to go get some loot! All right, so you're back there. Appears to be nothing over here. All right, hop. Man, these drawers suck. Eddie, you want to help me catch her, you know? Uh, do something besides uh, sitting there. Doing nothing. Not being helpful. Can I open a door so Maria can get in? So she's not like dead from a monster out there? So far, she's been the most helpful NPC out of everyone. I want her still around. You in here? I didn't see a monster creep up on Eddie. That's it, I'm leaving. Maria, just come in here. Laura, stop! It's dangerous! 
Joke's on you. I've already explored all this area. Maria? Did you see a little girl? Yeah, I tried to stop her, but she went that way. We can still catch her. Do we run? Lara? Good thing I explored most of this area. Good thing is you can outrun the monsters, right? Right? Ah, oh, windows haven't busted out yet. Doesn't appear to be anything in there. So I just committed vandalism. Nothing. Nothing. Am I to assume she just ran straight? Because I'm going to explore these back alleys if uh, they're here. So much big flap flap. Laura! Oh, that's not a good sign. Laura? Laura? Maria? Have you seen Laura? What is this place over here? Ah, big question mark. Okay, so maybe this is where we think she ran. Hello? What's this place? James, look. Where? Oh, don't go in there. Why are you running? I don't want to go in there. Hospitals suck as it is. Hospitals don't need to be in a horror game to be scary. What's this? Is that a gun cabinet? In a hospital? Yeah, but it's empty. Mm. Somehow that seems worse. Are we getting a shotgun now? Shotgun shells. One. Why you give me bigger bullets? Where did she go? I don't know. Let's look around. Oh, map. Perfect. Well, we've got quite the rooms to inspect. This is going to be a while. Doctors? Dr. Hughes and Dr. Atkinson in the garden. At least I got you with me. Got a friend. Got a teammate. Got someone to watch my back. Can't read that. Hmm. Due to the repeated instances of keys mis being getting... Due to, instance, due to the repeated instances of keys getting misplaced. From the point forward, due to the repeat, due to the repeated instances of keys getting misplaced, from this point forward, we are to, due to the repeated instances of keys getting misplaced. From this point forward, they are to be returned to the locker at the end of every shift. All staff are required to memorize the padlock combination and are not to disclose it to anyone but authorized personnel under any circumstances. In any in case of any problems, report to the head nurse in examination room three. Flip it over. Flip it over. Ah, nothing. I'll take that, though. What'd you see? Anything good? What about over here? The director requested the files of the three cru crucial patients. You know which ones. Could you please bring them... But could you please bring them to his office? Ah, drawer! Fantastic! Ah, it's empty! Bullshit! Ah, bullshit! 
Nope. She ran. I just spun in circles. She had a way better plan than I did. She ran for it. I'm like, ah, spin in a circle. In okay, so that's where we need to get the combination lock. We should look around. Might be written down somewhere. Nope, sorry. I should probably turn that off, right? That's probably rude. All right, go ahead and save. Rude of me to keep flashing my flashlight in your eyes. I'm, I, my apologies. Okay, let's go to the restrooms. Hey, we're not going there. Anyone in here? Inspecting for monsters! Potty monster? Health drink. What well, I would expect to find in a hospital. Oh, did you wait out here? Alright, so we need to go to examination room three. We got locker rooms back this way, so let's go ahead and explore those. Can I bust through this door? No. Can't go through there. Okay, so let's go ahead and head back. Guess let's go ahead and head to examination room three. Brookhaven Hospital. 1920. Hello? Remember, if you experience poor appetite or significant weight loss, insomnia or hyposomnia, loss of interest or pleasure in unusual activity, in the usual act unusual activities, in the usual activities, feeling of worthlessness, diminished ability to think or concentrate, please contact your healthcare provider immediately. Why, what do we think we got? Oh, there you are. Hey. There. Laura. Wait. Man, go get eaten by a monster okay. already. We don't want to hurt you. God damn it. Bunny. I don't think she likes me very much. But why? I, uh, I don't know. Bunny, wolf. Well, we're not going up there yet. I'm sent to the examination rooms. Bummer. Keep door closed. Why is that? Make my own way. Not sure. Better stay on your guard. I can break glass. Okay. Are you good out there? Don't get murdered. Okay, got that. Wait, what was that? Because where I saw an A pop up. All right. Well, let's go ahead and loot that. Nothing. There's something. I wrote down for you in a way you should finally be able to remember. Once you're in the lobby, just look around. Now remember, Dr. Nurse's Trees. Dr. Nurse's Trees. Dr. Nurse's Trees. So those paintings we're looking at, the pictures. Doctor Nurse's trees. Doctor Nurse's trees. Four trees. Oh shit, you scared me. Doctors, too. You, um, you looking for something in these photos? Oh, that's not good. Two, four, six, seven. 
That's not good. That's not good. That's not good. We had doctors, nurses, trees. What? We had two doctors. We had seven nurses. And we had four trees. Sorry. Two, four, six, seven. Sorry. And four trees. Doctor, nurses, trees. Two, four. Two, four, six, seven. Yes. So it should be two doctors, seven nurses, and four trees. Unless I'm supposed to do it the opposite. What? Nurses, doctors, trees. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. Second floor? Basement. Basement. Oh, of course. I don't want to go to the basement. Actually, I do want to go to the basement. Can't go through there. How do I get to basement? Try not to be rude and keep flashing my light in your face, but you're always right there. This place feels so empty. More than the other places we've been. It kind of makes me think of like that. Like, uh, it's really cool to like the see a band abandoned building some places but well, it's also got like that uh idea of just like where you're so used to so many people running around and it's being active and loud to actually enter it is just eerie kind of like that back rooms the end thing where it's just all like giant open spaces or just areas where you're just so used to so much hustle and bustle and then it's just quiet Nothing's going on. Do 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 do. Hello. Hello. Hmm. I don't know about this. I don't know about this. I may have never played Silent Hill games that much, but I definitely feel a little bit unnerved by that whole painting. Well, the picture of all the nurses, and I know they are an enemy. Trash can. That wasn't a trash can. Uh, a generator. You think you could get it working? Might get the elevator running again. Looks like it needs blood to run it. So we can find some blood, we can start it. You know where I can get some blood? Or a blood machine? There's more of them. What kind of them? Oh, 
No! 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 Oh shit, I better beat ya. No! No! I about to stomp it. Damn leggy monsters. What was that? Oh, okay, I thought it was like a code or something. So we got those down here, so we'll have to watch all corners. Because they're sneaky. Finish the job. I think they're gone. For now. Nope. Not the leggy monsters. They be sneaky as fuck. That one made a noise. Oh shit. Why would you run there? Gasoline. Oh, it's empty. That's not helpful. Shit, you just... You need to calm down. We need to set some boundaries here. You can't come up and start teleporting around I me. Mean, you can't run where I just killed a body. We gotta set some boundaries here. Because this is not... gonna work in our favor. I do like how sometimes the leg monsters just hang out there until we, like... You finally realize they're there. You! Are you trying to blind me, James? Until, uh, you, like... Your brain finally realizes what you're looking at, and it's like, oh, there's a monster there. And then it becomes active. James? No! 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 I knew there had to be a one around here. Oh, cool. I didn't look up. I looked at the boots. I was like, cool, boots. Probably what I need. Right, you can fit it through. All right, I'm gonna hop over here. You'll be fine, right? Don't worry. I'll be right back. You better. Doors unlocked. Come on around. I was hoping that was you. If not, it's gonna be very sad. Ah, oh, there seems to be ga the gas thingy. That sounded like a monster for a second. Glug, 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 glug. Gasoline. I was so expecting something to come through that door. Uh, Reed Hospital. I was so expecting something to come through that door. I do have light uh, radio interference, so one must be nearby.
Must be down there somewhere. I see you. No! 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 Alright, cool. Uh, nothing. Neat. That's even cooler. Let's go ahead and uh, get this. Run! Once I can realize what we're fighting. Move! No! 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 Right, my goal was purely to get through that door. I right, know we got a nerd somewhere down here. We heard the light uh, radio clicking. Move! What are you doing? No, no, no. Oh, shit. They respawned. Now, where is that generator? Oh, what's that? Running low on bleach, white laundry detergent, starch, white sheets. The amount of bleach you use is re getting ridiculous. The sheets are not getting whiter. I won't ask questions. Just end it. Excuse me. I saw that one. I was like, oh no. Okay. So the Jenny must be back here. I was like, something coming through there. Glug, 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 glug. Glug, 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 glug. Try to like to slide to the side. <laughs> Let's check out that elevator. Oh, I'll just stand the exhaust. One's got to be around here. No, no, no. Fair if I at least get one shot on it since it was right there. All right. Oh, the elevators. Oh, wait, why is this door open? That was intense. I still expect him one to be behind the door or something like that. Oh, bullets. We're all loaded up. Excuse me. Any reason to go back down here? Anything power related? I don't think so. I have a good feeling about this. I feel like we're going to go through like the Silent Hill area. Sorry I keep blinding you, but then I can't see when it's off, so I'm on my apologies. Right, I guess we're going up to the next floor. I don't know which door it's gonna open.
Okay, we got a cutscene instead. This is the floor that's going to open. So many cutscenes in this game. I like it. Because it did all the cutscenes very well. It always looks so good. Oh, man. You good over there? Are you? Hey. You okay? I'm sorry. That's fine. What's going on? Are you hurt? It's nothing. Probably just a hangover. Maybe you should rest. Yeah. Okay. As soon as I can. James? I wanted to ask you. What if you can't find Mary? What will you do? I haven't really thought about that. Back soon, okay? Hey! Are you okay? Sorry. Are you trying to sleep? Need help? I'm, right. I'm just tired. What you need? Does it make it hard to sleep? This is inconvenient? Okay. <laughs> Alright. We should probably lock... Could you lock this door or something? Or... Do something to protect yourself? Take care of what matters most. Leave the rest to us. Tolika Palliative Care Center. What's that? Like, it looks like a zombie taking care of that person. Alright. Ooh, sp spoopy red... Oh, that's a... That's a save point. I was like, spoopy red bathroom of doom. Figured, uh, just do some quick runs, see if we can find any items. And I'll see what time we're at. Like I said, I'm still trying to keep it, like, almost an hour, roughly, per, uh, part. I can unlock it. Neat. Oh, this must be the stairwell. Okay. Oh, well. Now we've got that unlocked. What's this? Hello? Nothing. I don't have a good feeling about Maria. Like, even though I'm the most sus of her, she's also the only NPC that's actually, like, helped me. I don't know what her motives are yet, but she's the only one to actually, like, do something and assist me instead of, like, be not helpful at all. I try this? No. Maybe I did. Maybe I didn't. I don't know. Bam. I just want to make noises. This is the red room. That's a no room. This is the Maria room. And it's... Alright. Well, we are getting close to the hour mark. 
so I think I'm going to go ahead and run back here and save. That's not the place I want to go to. That's not the place. There we go. Okay. Ah! The way he just like stepped back like, ah! Okay. All right, right on. So we have continued. We have found, we went to the theater. We found Eddie and found out her name was Laura. Uh, we went through the theater, chased Laura, found a hospital, went through there, did some puzzles, and now we're up here where Maria is going to sleep. And I do not have a good feeling about that. Like, she is also the most character where I'm like, kind of like, what's your motives? Who are you? And then like in my joking mind, when she's just like, I look like your wife, right? Tell me about her. I can be whatever you want me to be. <laughs> makes me like, she's like, makes me like jokingly think she's like a mimic or a fae or a doppelganger or something like that. And she's going to turn around and just like beat her ass, a skin stealer or something. I doubt completely that's what she is. She's probably just another human wrapped up in this. I am curious about her story though. Eddie just kind of annoys me. I don't know what his story is, but he seems kind of worthless. Uh, otherwise, Laura still don't know her story. She's just more annoying because she keeps running away, but there must be some reason why she's running away. But overall, still interested to see what's going on. When we jump back in, we'll go through the hospital and explore some more. Uh, I do know a tiny bit of Silent Hill stuff. So I know there's nurse enemies and we're in the hospital. So I think we might meet up with them. I could be wrong, but judging by that picture down the nurse picture before, oh, uh, just uh, by the nurse picture before I'm going to assume that we're going to meet him here. And those leggy monsters suck. They suck so much. All right. That'll be all for now. If you want to give us a game a shot yourself, link will be down below. If you made it this far, why not like, comment, subscribe. Do whatever your brain meat desires. Thank you for wasting some time, and I will catch you later. Bum bum bum. <laughs>